Hi guys, welcome to Talk Time with Cindy, and I, this is a new segment I have, and yeah, I just got a new haircut, <laughs> hi, right, um, anyway, I have, um, I have this new segment that I'm creating, and I have this, this job where I'm, I'm, I get to interview people for YouTube, it's awesome, um, but anyway, I have, the, uh, basically the queen of Hollywood right now, Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Come on, Kim. I'm sorry it took me so long. They were just doing my makeup back there in the back. Like they're they were like all over me. It's crazy. Hollywood's crazy. Hey everybody, how's it going? I am like so starstruck right now. You are Kim Kardashian. That is amazing. Well, I I am on a new interviewer show, so I'm actually very excited. It's very it's very nice to meet you, oh my God. Cindy. I love watching your videos with your boyfriend or oh fiance, my God. whatever like you want to so, go. I am like so gushing right now. Like, oh my god. You're too kind. That's so like, awesome. Like, you're, you're sweet. You're sweet, sweetie. So, um, yeah, since this is an interview, <laughs> I just said that. Um, anyway, I should probably start asking you questions, but I'm kind of nervous right now. I'm sorry. Oh, no, sweetie. You don't need to be nervous. I'm just like you. Just a normal person. <sighs> just somewhat glamorous, you know? Well, anyway. Um. <laughs> so... You just started the show, right? Yeah. Yeah. And, and you have a nice audience, it looks like. I mean, I cannot wait for these people to... I can't, I can't wait for you to get more views on this. I'm so excited. I know, right? Yeah, like, I'm so excited. Like, this, I hope this works out. I mean, I hope people watch it. I hope so, too. I will spread the word for you, doll. I'm actually getting paid for it, but this is just, like, my trial, you know? Yeah. Oh. I didn't know they do trials for these things, but okay. Well, this company would come out with me, you know. Yeah. So, anyway. Well, you um, a good foundation. Anyway. Um, why did you name your baby Northwest? Oh, my sweet, precious little Nori. Okay, okay. Um, me and Kanye, we actually sat down and was thinking about this before I went to the hospital. And we had actually quite a few names picked out. But we were thinking, like... Me and him have been best friends uh -huh. for um, quite some time now, and as you know, back a couple years ago, me and Chris, hum me and Chris Humphreys didn't work mm -hmm. out, and yes. so me and Kanye just kind of grew closer and closer, so when Nori was inside me, and it was almost time to have her, we, um, we thought it was like a magical gift from the gods, and so we're like, how about Northwest, because she's like following our North Star. Oh and my just, god, that's I awesome. know, right? She's the most precious oh little god. thing. Okay, like, and she I, changes every day. Like, some days she looks like Kanye, some days she'll look like me. Oh, you have no idea. Like, I, I want to send you some pictures right now, actually. Um, too bad I can't. I didn't have time. Too bad I can't uh, take that name. If that was already taken when I have a baby someday, I would totally name her uh, or him. Uh, either way, what, I, it's a very well, tragic thing. Middle name yes. West, because obviously I can't take. Uh, so. <laughs> oh, bless you, sweetie. Oh. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, it's okay. It's all right. I mean, you're normal. You're human, and you treat me like a human, so I like it. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> that that's so beautiful. So. Yeah, yeah, she's a doll. Like, I'll have to bring her on here sometime if you ever interview me again. Oh I'm sure god. the world would love to see her. Oh my her. god, yes. But see, uh, Kanye has this issue, like, he wants to keep Nori out of the spotlight as much as he can, because he doesn't like the paparazzi. So. I can see that on, on uh, E! and all those other places. Yeah, our and, channel, yeah. Yeah, yeah he do, he's not one for the spotlight, but I can understand, because I live in it. So, um, next question. What is your next project? My next project? Well, I am actually doing a lot of things. Kanye was just at Fashion Week, as you know, with Kendall. Oh my god, and no, Yeah, really, over in the Oh my god, actually, yeah, I need to have, sorry. I, I, uh -huh. I, I ever get um, sometimes. And I just uh, I was on a little luncheon date with this guy, mm -hmm. and my mom, Chris, was there as well. Um, and that went pretty well. Um, we're just like doing a lot with 
clothes and modeling and of course our TV show Keeping Up with the Kardashians. It's gonna it's getting get more intense. Oh my god, really? Um, I can't wait. Oh, oh yeah, my yeah, god, yeah. yes. It's gonna get way more intense. Like some things that happen are gonna be really sad, traumatic, and oh my stuff. God. And of course Nori's there now. Um, but I'm more focused on my wedding right now. It's gonna be coming up in the summer with Kanye because I'm. Uh, it's gonna be blissfully exciting. Oh my god, that's amazing. Um, yeah, thank you. <laughs> I like how you do your show, just so free and fly. Woo! Things just fly everywhere in this show. Yeah, I like it. Together. Yeah. Anyway, um, how do you? How? I'm sorry. Uh, how do you respond to people when they call you stupid? Oh. Or like. This whole hate bullying thing, like, people just don't understand. I'm just like them. Like, I wish they would just really understand this. I'm no different than they are. I mean, <laughs> yes, I get paparazzi crazy. I live in Hollywood. Yeah. Uh, and I get tweets all the time, like, so rude. And they're like, your baby's name's so stupid. And I feel why do you time, do girl. that? Or you're Bad. You need to lose the baby weight. There's haters all the way out there, sweetie, and you just gotta ignore those people and move on because you know you're better than them. I see that all the time, girl. Like, yeah. it's, it's unbelievable. If you follow me on Twitter, I retweet some of them and just be like, I cannot believe this. So. I, just, just ignore them, girl. Just, oh, I do. You, just... you have to ignore them because you know that you're better than them, even though you are just like them. You gotta be so. Everybody's I, like each other. We're all human in this world. They're just jealous of you because you're so fabulous. Oh, thank you. You're such a doll. I really like being on this show. Okay, so next question. Um, what are? Okay, I guess you just kind of answered this question, but um, what are we to expect on the next episodes? Uh, episode of the Kardashians. Season okay, well, our season finale is coming up. Um, in the season finale, I don't want to give away too many spoilers, but it's gonna involve Chloe a lot. Oh my god. Um, Chloe and Lamar, as everybody knows, they have they they're in a divorce right now. Yeah, I've been um, hearing about that a lot. Like, actually, and like, there's so many tweets on Facebook. I'm young. Yes, it's trending. Um, it trended a lot when it was happening and the news came out and broke. Oh my but God, Chloe yeah. was heartbroken in the episode, and so it just pretty much revolved around Chloe. Um, and me and Courtney are there in her support, and my mom, of course, and Bruce. But, yeah, you'll just have to wait and see what happens and why her and Lamar got a divorce, if you don't already know. Okay, okay, good answer, good answer. Very truthful. Yeah. Anyway, um... <laughs> Why? Why? What's so funny? I want to know. I want to laugh along. Uh, no reason. No, nothing. Oh. Um, will you be getting a puppy for Baby Norris? A puppy. Um, you know, me and Kanye haven't really talked about it yet, because she's still so little and still a baby, and she's still growing, so we yeah. want to put all of our attention towards her right now, and we are also trying to move into our own place and out my mom's house, so I think maybe a puppy would maybe be in the lines of thinking maybe when she turns five or six. Oh my god, that would be so perfect. Bring it, the uh, dog and her can grow up together. Like, I think it would be a cute little thing. It would be, like, a little Pomeranian or something like that, but or then, a Pom Chow or something Then again, like that. baby Nor is going to be a lot, she's going to be a lot with her cousins, uh, Mason... And Penelope, because, well, me and Kanye are just busy with our modeling and all our business stuff. And yeah. Sometimes Courtney's even with me, so the nanny or my mom's got to take over, but it, it'll all work out. Yeah, I'm sure it will. I'm sure it will. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I just think every little kid should have a puppy by the, the time they get, like, the five. Oh, because... I agree. I think it's so adorable when, like, you see those pictures, like, with the dog and the kid aging together. I just think that's the most adore thing ever. I, ha I had one once. It was so cute. It's so adoring. Anyway, um, it died though. I killed it. Oh, <laughs> you killed your. That's so sad. I feel like we need to have a long discussion after this, after this interview is over, because uh, I I want to talk to you about my childhood too, because it sounds like we have very familiar <laughs> things. <laughs> it's so funny. I think we really do. Oh my god, yes. Um. Anyway. <laughs> 
is your wedding going to be on TV like it was when you and Chris got married? Um, <laughs> I'm leaving this all up to Kanye this time around because, like I said, you know he's very he iffy with the pop, be, right, and yes. um, all the popularity and all that. Very you know? true. So I'm leaving it up to him. We do know we are not going to have it in the U.S. We are going out of the U.S. to have the wedding. Um, but it's all a surprise. I'm leaving it up to him if it's televised or not. But it is going to be a small and quaint wedding instead of, like, when me and Chris Humphreys got married. I don't like to talk about that man a lot. Oh that, that, that's intense. That's kind of intense. It was a very intense divorce. Yes, it was. Oh, my God. That sounds intense. <laughs> it was. Very, very intense. Anyway, everything's intense right now. Um, okay, next question. How did you lose all the weight after uh, after the baby? This is a hard question that I always answer for women that always come at me on Twitter because they're like, you look so beautiful and you have a lot of courage just to post almost a naked photo of yourself on Instagram. Well, you have to get to the gym immediately and start working out, girls, oh because God. that baby fat will not just go away on its own. You're just going to turn flabby. And I am taking down notes right now on good, this because, good. I mean, I probably won't be having a baby with uh, with my man anytime soon, but, I mean, just in case, you know. Right, right. You know, it's, always, it's always good to listen. Because I might forget, you know. Um, you know. Yeah, so. um, but yeah, and you just need to hit the gym like a lot. Like I went to the gym about six days a week and took off on Sundays. And it's just hard balancing everything with the baby, your career, your almost gotta be wedding pretty soon. It's you, it's just difficult. With you, but, be, you being so amazing, it's it's gotta be tough. It really does. Oh, it really is. And every door you walk out, the cameras are always flashing in your face. Like there's never a moment alone, so Oh, yeah. So. <laughs> that was my interview with Kim Kardashian. It was very nice meeting you, Cindy. And it was very nice talking to all you guys. And I love doing this interview. I, I would be pleased to come back anytime you would like to request me. Oh, you me. are so welcome. Anytime. Oh, thanks, doll. Like any You're such a uh, doll. I love you. Oh, my God. Yay. All right. Well, bye, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the interview. Bye. And let's all give Cindy an amazing round of applause for her very first interview, guys. Oh, my God. She did a very good job. You're my show notes. So amazing. Oh, sweetie, I don't need no more jobs in my life. Okay, guys, we hope you enjoyed our new segment. Um, I just interviewed Blank, and you just interviewed Kim Kardashian. Blank. <laughs> what? Well, <laughs> with the segments, they're not going to know who we're interviewing, so it's going to be, I just interviewed blah, blah, blah. Oh. But, um, yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this, leave a thumbs up. Um, if you want to see more of this, and, uh, if you have any other celebrities you want to see Cindy interview, please leave the comments down below and we will see if we get that person to be interviewed. So thanks for watching Chillers and random people on the internet. I just found this guy and her this girl. A little channel called Bone Sugar 21. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching like always. If you don't normally watch our channel and you like what you saw, subscribe. And you guys can follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook at BangTube21. They're all the same. Just type the damn thing They're in. They're all the same. Good. Um, so, yeah. Yep. <laughs> so, thanks for watching, guys. And we'll be back tomorrow for a safe Sunday. Bye. Bye.